Which paragraph is correct? Christopher likes toy vehicles and made a chart of the ones he owns. There is one plane and one sports car. Which paragraph corresponds to the toys Christopher has? Christopher has one plane and one sports car. And this graph shows the value and the sports cars that he owns. He owns one plane, and this graph shows one. He owns one sports car, and this graph shows one sports car. So I think this is the right answer. This is not the right answer because it says planes. Five. That means he owns five planes. Does he own five planes? He only owns one. So this answer is not correct. Let's choose the right one. That's right. Matthew's mom gave him a chart of the fruits he needs to buy. The chart has two oranges and two grapes. Which bar graph corresponds to what Matthew needs to buy? This bar graph shows the values and oranges, grapes, the fruits that he needed to buy. Now he needs to buy two oranges and two grapes. And this bar graph shows oranges, two, grapes, two. So I think this is the right graph. This is not the right one because it says orange. And it, it means he needs to buy four oranges, which doesn't match. So the answer is the left one. Awesome! In his pocket, Logan has four dimes and two pennies. Which bar graph corresponds to the money in Logan's pocket? He has four dimes and two pennies. Let's look at the dimes and four. So this is correct. Pennies, it needs to be at two, which is correct. So this bar graph is the correct bar graph. This is not right because it says dimes and it goes three and pennies is at one nice work for a pirate school assignment natalie made a chart of the furniture in her room there are two chairs and one treasure chest which bar graph corresponds to natalie's furniture Let's circle the important numbers here. Two chairs and one treasure chest. Chairs, five. Hmm. She doesn't have five chairs. She only has two. So this graph is not correct. She has two chairs. Chairs, two, and treasure chest, one. So this bar graph corresponds to Natalie's furniture. Let's choose the right one. That's right. In Ashley's kitchen, there are four teacups and one plate. Which bar graph corresponds to the contents of the kitchen? She has four teacups and one plate. Teacups needs to be at four, but it says two. So this is not the right bar graph. How about this? Teacups, four, plates, one. So this graph corresponds to the contents of the kitchen. Let's choose the right one. Super! For a pirate school assignment, Landon made a chart of the furniture in his room. There are two chairs and four trash cans. 
which bar graph corresponds to Landon's furniture. He has two chairs and four trash cans. Let's check. Chairs is at one. Trash cans, one. So this does not correspond to Landon's furniture. This is not correct. How about this? Chairs, two. So this is right. Trash cans, four. So this bar graph corresponds to Landon's furniture. Awesome. Four more to go. In her pocket, Brianna has five nickels and two quarters. Which bar graph corresponds to the money in Brianna's pocket? She has five nickels and two quarters. Nickels, three. Hmm, so this is not right. Quarters, one. So this bar graph does not correspond to the money in Brianna's pocket. How about this one? Nickels, five, so this is right. Quarters, two, so this is perfect. This graph corresponds. Let's choose the right one. Correct. For a pirate school assignment, Ethan made a chart of the furniture in his room. There are two trash cans and two chairs. Which bar graph corresponds to Ethan's furniture? two trash cans and two chairs. Let's look at the bar graph. Trash cans, two, chairs, two. So this bar graph corresponds to Ethan's furniture. That's right. Madison is doing inventory at her sporting goods store. She saw four skateboards and one basketball. Which bar graph corresponds to what Madison saw? She saw four skateboards and one basketball. Let me erase it and do it again. Four skateboards and one basketball. Skateboards, four. Basketball, one. So this bar graph corresponds to what Madison saw. This is wrong because skateboards four, this is right, but basketball three, this is not right because she only saw one basketball. Awesome, one more question. In his pocket, Alexander has one penny and five dimes. Which bar graph corresponds to the money in Alexander's pocket? one penny and five dimes let's look at the bar graph penny one dimes five so this is the right one this bar graph corresponds to the money in alexander's pocket so let's choose the left one super great job 